Well, she was the only other person there when Atlanta attorney Tex MacGyver fatally shot his wife, Diane. Today, Danny Joe Carter took to the stand to begin the second week of MacGyver's murder trial. MacGyver admits he shot his wife, but he claims it was an accident. The prosecution argues it was murder. Well, Fox Vice Angelique Proctor was in the courtroom for today's testimony. And Angelique, this is one of the prosecution's key witnesses. What a huge witness for this case. Danny Jo Carter says she was Diane McIver's best friend. The two were friends for 40 years. She is critical to the prosecution because she is likely the only person that will walk jurors through exactly what happened during that shooting. He said, girls, I wish you hadn't have done this. This is a really bad area. Danny Joe Carter was the only witness who saw Tex MacGyver ask for his gun because they were in a bad area, then shoot his wife, Diane, minutes later. Carter, who had been friends with Diane for 40 plus years, showed jurors the route down Piedmont Avenue they took. She said they were stopped at a light when she heard a loud bang. I heard a big boom and I, didn't, I didn't know what it was. I thought there was an explosion somewhere. Then Danny Joe says Diane immediately addressed her husband. She turned around this way. She flung around and she says, Tex, what did you do? Tex, what did you do? Mm -hmm. And did he say anything? He said the gun discharged. Danny Joe says Tex told her to go to Emory Hospital and gave her directions. Neither of them called 911. Then she says Tex told her to watch out. There may be people with baby carriages in the area. Diane was unconscious by this time as emergency personnel whisk her in. Danny Joe says Tex called his attorney, Steve Maples, about 10 to 15 minutes after they arrived at the hospital. She also said Tex told her he hated for her to get wrapped up in this. You just need to say you came down here as a friend of the family. I said I can't lie. Now, Danny Joe Carter has been on the stand for about five hours. They have not even began cross-examination, so we will see her, no doubt, tomorrow as well.